So this is just a quick message to all you anti-gunners out there. And you, of course, know who you are. You're the people that hear somebody call an AR-15 an assault rifle or a military-style rifle, and you jump on the ban the AR-15 bandwagon. Nobody, no law-abiding sedition should be able to get a hold of something so dangerous, never mind the fact that thousands upon thousands upon thousands upon thousands of times every year, it is verifiable that people defend themselves with these types of firearms and their loved ones as well. You're probably also the type of person that says we need more gun control. We need more gun restrictions because we're not living in the Old West anymore. We have cops now, right? Cops. You know, the guys that show up about 15 minutes after you're already dead? Yeah, that. So I've been hearing a lot about this whole AR-15 ban thing. and I just wanted to give you a little bit of truth, a little knowledge, a little facts to base your decisions off of. You see, about 350 times a year, somebody dies because of a rifle. Now, only about half of that is at a semi-auto rifle, something you would classify as an assault rifle. So that's about 175 times a year somebody dies because of what you would call an assault rifle. Pretty simple, right? Here's the problem. The vast majority of those fall into one of two categories. Either A, they're a criminal that was shot by a cop who had one of these rifles, or B, they're a criminal who was shot by another criminal who had one of these rifles, probably due to drugs or gangs. That's just a fact, and therein lies the problem. You see, you have a better chance of dying because of bees, or spiders, or wasps, or ladders, or even lightning, than you do of dying by one of these quote-unquote assault rifles. Let me tell you something, anti-gunners. The science is settled, and when you fall in line with this way of thinking, that ordinary law-abiding citizens shouldn't have these guns because they're so dangerous, you yourself are a science denier.